a whole lot worse. He picks up third place for today. Sebastian Vettel, it's a podium and a second podium at Aston Martin for him. It's the first time that Silverstone-based team have ever been on the podium here at the Hungaro Ring in, under any name. And how about this for Alpine, who have won as Benetton, have won as Renault, won as Lotus, and now they won as Alpine. That Enstone team will enjoy this for a while. Lewis Hamilton looks absolutely exhausted. Esteban Ocon, as you'd understand, absolutely elated. Special, special moment for this young man on the track with Fernando Alonso. Got his first win in Formula One. Well, Esteban Ocon, his teammate, has done exactly that as well. Uh, they pick up a rather unusual looking trophy. Uh, he cares not. He raises it aloft. Victory for Esteban Ocon and for Alpine. Sebastian Vettel at second today. Well, he picks up another podium for his new team. His teammate, Lance Stroll, are given a five-place grid penalty for the next race for causing a collision at the start today. Same for Lewis Hamilton, too, whose teammate, Valtteri Bottas, is also uh, given a five-place grid penalty for Spa. Hamilton does look exhausted, Nico. Yeah, I mean, first of all, so what, a, what a great great weekend for Vettel. Uh, trying to come back from all those difficult years and Lewis, yeah, look at his body language. Huh? I don't know if he's like severely like dehydrated. Look at how he's breathing heavily and everything. He can hardly stand it seems. So uh, it must have been an extremely tough, tough race for him in that car. Super hot or dehydration. So no, difficult to understand. What a race it's been. I promise you, they're not all like this, Nico, but you're welcome back to the commentary box any time if your presence is going to give us a Hungarian Grand Prix or any race uh, like this. It closes a run of 28 Grand Prix in 56 weeks since the start of the 2020 season. It closes it in fine style for Ocon and Alpine in a recovery mission for Lewis Hamilton and for Mercedes and for the second race running. An absolute horror for Red Bull. The title lead goes to Mercedes in drivers and constructors we're going to take a summer break. Join us on the other side. There's a lot more to play for in 2021. 